what's up guys this is Bubba TV 24 and welcome to the channel today we are back in create a cart ride we are in the Viking duck ride you guys voted on my channel on the community tab on Friday and Viking duck one we will be doing this one one more and maybe a third depending on how long it takes to do this but I want to give a quick shout out to FMR Fanster for submitting two cart rides and to Zach Lomer. They both requested shout outs. Big thanks to everybody who is a big supporter of the channel. But here we are to the hill, the hill to the aisle. We are here. Five levels, 4.8 kilometers. Looks like we have a bit of an obby. I've heard that this is a fun one. Time record. DM the owner of the cart ride with proof if you break the record. So 2052. Before playing, level three is very difficult and may cause rage. Be aware of before you start okay and we are off here we go we have rocks okay question of the day before we get into it what is ouch that was an X what is your favorite movie I am a really big fan of what the heck of the Ninja Turtles kind of always have been. And I think that one of the best Ninja Turtle movies, probably the best Ninja Turtle movie, was the first one from like really long ago. And I absolutely loved it. I, I thought it was phenomenal. I think it's probably, dang dude, one of the, the best representations of the Ninja Turtles and heck even the, like one of the best representations of the original Ninja Turtles, loved it. Thought it was hilarious a uh, little bit dark i thought it was really dark there's a line in it where uh it's after raf gets captured and he is tied up and the turtles are sneaking and trying to get him and they're like oh keep your eyes peeled yeah it's quiet a little too quiet and they're like yeah it's this a little too this and they see raf and they're like it's raf yeah a little too raf it's such a good film the second one is a little bit weird in comparison i don't think it's as good but it's it's still good and then the third one is just well the third one's not good let's be honest the third turtles movie from the original trilogy of turtles movies was absolutely awful but i still have as bad as it is the suits are worse everything but as bad as it is i still have a soft spot in my heart for it this is this is hard by the way this is pretty hard quick update on the second channel i have begun the review process please stay under 35 or you could die okay i begin the review process of the game hell divers 2 and i've got a script out i just need to make sure it's ready to go and I need to put it together, but that is going to be the next review. I was going to do Starfield, but I'm going to be honest, I can't, I don't want to even review it anymore. I can't even bring myself to review it. That game was so disappointing, but Helldivers 2, yeah. Uh, I will have that out sometime relatively soon, and I will make an announcement on this channel if you guys want to go see that. So that is my second channel. It's called Bubba TV 24 Reviews, and yep, that's what I'll be working on. So having a good time with that one. Okay, I see the end up here. I just need to dodge some stuff, and we'll be there. Now, this is level three, so this is uh, this level is not going to be nerfed. Okay, so we're talking about another uh, they did warn at the beginning this is going to be a very difficult one so i get it we may if i can't get through it may have to go and do uh some cart resets then but we'll see how far i get into it before i actually fail and of course i don't know how long it is oh i see lots of uh stone droppers here lots of axes i'm pretty far into it what i don't know is where the ending is oh i made it Wait, that was level three? That wasn't that hard at all. Wait, people found that super difficult? Final level, I made this level more easier than the last as a break for you. Thank you, that's always appreciated. I didn't think level three was all that hard. I didn't even take any damage. Uh, if this is, is this the last level? It did, oh my gosh. We're at the bomb cart. Okay, the bomb cart really only goes for that one little area, but it's pretty, pretty fast, so. It ends very quickly. So, okay, we're kind of at the bottom here of the world. And, oh, that killed me. Dang it. I didn't think it was going to hit me. Okay. Well, start again. I don't know how close I am to actually finishing this level, to be honest with y'all. I feel like I should be, ouch, I should be pretty darn close. I see something here. Is this the ending? 
we did it. Level five. Here we go. We made it to the end. And we got the Viking cart. Uh, so I beat it, and I have no proof of this. I can't really show you this, but I beat it, and I'm looking at my Audacity recording. So I've been recording now for 13 and a half minutes, and the first minute of that was getting the video intro. So I probably beat this in about 12 minutes. Um, there's no, I, I mean, I can't really provide proof unless I did a completely uncut a uh, raw edit but that you'll just have to take my take my word for it but that's okay i don't want to be on the leaderboards anyway okay we did it level five we finished it this one was good by33qt and pug facial very nicely let's very nice let's go back to the lobby here and take a look at our viking duck oh okay i don't know why I did i thought this was like a barrel or something a, a shield makes sense pretty cool i like it the hypersonic rainbow cloud. Two levels, 17 kilometers. Oh no, it's these guys again. And we are off into the wild blue. Let's see if we can make this without dying. Nice. What just happened? And I don't know. It just, I can't make that jump without just starting to turn for some reason. Let's see if I can get there. It looks like we will be using resets on this level most likely. And yeah, I'm just turning for no reason. I don't know why I'm not even holding anything. And, and, and I made it. Heck yeah, let's get moving. Okay, we have to take the rest of this very carefully then. Cause I do not want to have to do that jump again. And I actually, I probably just won't. I will probably at this point just reset. Oh my gosh, if she would have been on the tracks and killed me, I'd have gone insane. Yeah, I, I think I remember the last one of these that we did where you go so fast that like, yeah, it's the 19 kilometers or whatever, but like you go so quickly that it's like two seconds. So we're just gonna just keep doing this. We're gonna reset on these cause these levels are long. I don't know how close I am to finishing this, but I do know that I've had to use a lot of resets to get here. <laughs> And I think this is the next level, actually. Yeah, we made it, level two. Archipelago two. I don't know how, you would have to be so extraordinarily lucky to get past that first area without some sort of a reset. And it's just a difficult of length. It's just a, it's just, it's a length thing. Because even though this is a huge level and it makes you go pretty fast, like you, you get a lot of speed very quickly. The big issue is that if you get too much speed, you'll just go flying off the track because of the twists and stuff. They'll they'll bump you off. Legitimately, I think if you really want to not fall off, you need to probably stay within 100 miles per hour just because that seems to be kind of a sweet spot there of not getting rattled off. But here it is. We got it. It is very cool looking, actually. It's a really cool cart. Here it is, the hypersonic rainbow cart. Is that what it's called? Hypersonic rainbow cloud. There we go. It's not really a rainbow all that much, but looks pretty cool. Let's do one more. Aerial archipelago. Oh, very angry. We have 11 levels, 13 kilometers. And, oh, whoa, okay. Where am I going? What am I doing? I'm actually going to the next area instead of like a teleport. Boom, crash landed, Desertus Insula. So we have bumps on this one. Oh, very, eh, eh. Get me over the bump, please. Let me get, um, let me get this cart. There we go, yep, my cart was too low, unfortunately. Eh, oh, fire, I'm on fire, am I dead? No, it doesn't look like it, but I do see a cart behind me somewhere, and I don't, oh, it's, it's catching up, and we made it. I think we made it. And we are to the ice area, crashed. And here we go. All right, where are we going? I, it looks like a maze of some sort. An ice maze that we have to sort of navigate through. It looks like something and it's different. It is, that's where, we, that's where we're going. Oh, we did it, okay, good, finally. Boom, we made it. Oasis Insula. Oh, it's a skeletons, skelly boys, hello. Literal stone balls trying to kill me. Fire everywhere. The music is funky though. Here we go. Oh! And I think we made it. Oh, I am in. Oh, yes! We are in the metal zone. This is my zone right here, boys. Oh, yeah. Get the double bass going. We just need a breakdown. That's all we need. Oh, yeah. And we need some screams. We need some screams. Maybe some good cleans in the chorus. A little metalcore vibes there. Oh, oh, okay. We made it. 
And now we're out of the middle zone. I'm not gonna say that Margaritaville is like, you know, the best place to get food. But, you know, sometimes you just gotta experience it. Whoa! Wasn't expecting that at all. No, it wasn't. The week shall not pass. I made it, but I am like one little just... I am a fart away from death. Like, I am one spicy chipotle burrito fart away from dying. Don't you touch me. Don't you touch me. Oh, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. You're getting a little bit too close there, cannonballs. Go. Go, go, go. We made it. Okay, good. And spider zone is the worst zone. Here we go. We made it. We made it. We go past more spiders. Get out of here, spiders. And it's the longest zone so far. Okay, we made it to the end. Ugh. What the heck? Okay, we are out of spider zone. Now we're in some like cyberpunk super cyber future and uh, there's fire everywhere. So this is a hor- oh no, this is a horrible future when there's fire everywhere. All right, cyber city, not too bad so far. Uh, there is one little area that you need to be careful of. It is, um, there's a little, there's a little part that if you're not going fast enough, you can just get stuck on the track because there are two pieces of track that kind of like, you can't really see it, but they kind of stick up. Whoa, that's a weird noise. They stick up like ever so slightly. And so you just get stuck between them. Oh, we are in a, I can't, oh, I can't see the track. We are going ever upwards, ascending to the heavens. Okay, we have to hit the universal reset. The Tempest of Time, a universal reset. Island 10. And it looks like it's basically the last level, but angry and red, and we're going all the way down to the bottom. I wonder if I can cheese it. Anything? No. I think I'm almost there. I think there's not a ton left. There we did it. Island 11. I miss it. Here it is right here. I walked right past it. It looked like the wall to me for a minute. Uh, we did it. So we beat this one. Archipelago. Ethereal Archipelago. Okay. We have a pyramid that we are on top of. I hope there are no pharaohs that get mad at me. Uh, or Mayans or... What are they? Or any other sort of indigenous tribes that had pyramids because uh, this isn't, this doesn't look Egyptian. This looks like Mayan or Incan or something like that. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like on it. Feel free to subscribe, hit that notification bell. I will see you guys next time. I've been BubbaTB24 and I am signing out.